I think this is uh, I think this is day number six of our seven day challenge of uploading here every day on KOT 4Q reacts. And we may extend the seven for seven to something even larger. You ready? So today we have the craziest accidental shots in the NBA. Uh, this is from House of Highlights. I love their compilations because it's actually like throughout history. No disrespect to any other guys, but um, a lot of their clips end up being from the last couple seasons. House of Highlights, GD, all of the homies that work there, they go deep. You can see right off rip. This Atlanta Hawks team. This is old Atlanta Hawks. Look at the jerseys. Look at the look at the logo. So let's see what's going on. Let's get into it. Evan Turner lobs it up and gets a three. That's the only way ET gonna hit his threes. You know what I'm saying? And look, he can't even half laugh. Look at that pass. Beautiful. Beautiful. And he's gonna do the three pointers. Okay. Marco Bellinelli. Off the screen, Roy Hibbert. Y'all remember Roy Hibbert play for the, the Charlotte Hornets? Oh, my God. They paid that man. Oh, no, no. They didn't pay him. I think they traded for him after the Lakers paid for him. Something. He ended up there somehow. And it was he just wasn't very good at that point. CP. All right. A three. No good. Yeah, that can't be it because that's not accidental. But the Larry Dance tip in 100% accidental. And Lou Williams like, bro, grasp, firmly grasp it. That's wild. Is that way? Is Ray Hibbert on that on the court too? Ray Hibbert's right there. Look at Ray Hibbert. He's everywhere. Every clip. That's crazy. Nice. Manu. Oh, that's when he tried to miss it. It's just like when you're good, you're good, bro. When you're good, you're good. And you know what? He tried hard to miss that one too. He threw that ball hard. But if you don't know, it has to hit the rim. It can't just hit backboard. So he had to at least touch the rim. And it went in. I can't even normally hit a free throw. And this man trying to miss and he hit it. Look at look at the teammate. Teammates like, bro. What? Come on, dog. David Lee was on the team. I don't remember that. Sticking with Manu. Good three. Add it up. And look, Malik, Michael Beasley think that he missed it. <laughs> that's confusing, bro. And that's old Manu. We talking last year of his NBA career, Manu. That ball went in. Hey, the rest don't always get it right. You remember the James Harden dunk that was out, but it was in, and it was out, but it was in, but they counted it as out. You know what I'm talking about? That's three points, baby. That's an easy three points, too. Counting them up. Michael Beasley, he ain't paying attention, dog. That's how you know man's ain't playing defense. He just grabbed that ball and went. He just grabbed that ball and went. He's like, that's it. I'm about to give me a quick bucket. Good shot, Marcin. Who get credited for that shot? I don't even know who that was. I can't even tell. I can't even tell. Who is that? Oh, Corey Joe. That's Corey Joseph. Corey Joseph add two to his career stats. Because it always goes to the closest person on the team. Okay. Jamal Murray tips it up to... Okay. And Vucevic gets that bucket. Can't do nothing but laugh at it, man. You can't do nothing to laugh at it. Now, in some situations, if it's late game, that's when you upset. But early game like this, you can't do nothing to laugh. It's two points. Now, if they lost their game, but ended up losing by two points. Hey, we counted that as a poster, dog. We counted that one as a poster. Draymond. Oh, man. Draymond, you got dunked on twice? Come on, dog. Shooter's touch for sure on the dunk. A shooter's touch bounce on the dunk. Uh. Norris Cole. Oh, look at this lineup for the Bulls. Jesus Christ. Marquise Teague? Ray Allen to Taj to Chris Anderson. Birdman gets a bucket, and we're down by 20. Just like that. We're down by 20. <laughs> Typical. Actually, not a bad Bulls team. It just happened that Marquise Teague is in the court, on the court at this moment. And he's the reason why that point went in. Yep. Back at the garden, but this time we got LeBron. Nice lob to Jason Kidd. 
<laughs> oh, it's a Jason Kidd. Hey, these were not bad Knicks teams, man. Jason Kidd, Melo, Tyson Chandler. These were not bad Knicks teams. No good. And Matt Barnes. Matt Barnes. Hey, man, shout out to Matt Barnes, bro. The podcast that he has is legendary, especially right now during quarantine, bro. It's like they're dropping episodes like every day, it seems like. And all of them are quality with different NBA players, different people in the media. They've been doing a great job, man, keeping me entertained. Andre Blatch, y'all remember that name? So I definitely do. Oof. Brad. Thanks, Rasheed. We'll take those. So who gets? The, who was the closest player on the court there? Was it still Brad Miller? Because he didn't get back on defense? Thank you, Sheed. We'll take those. <laughs> oh, man. We appreciate the easy buckets. I don't know how this game ended. Um, and it probably ended with a Boston Celtics win, if we're being honest with each other. But it is what it is. Alfred Payton, before he cut his hair. Count the three. Where are the fans? Do you hear how, how empty the arena is right now? Listen, please listen. Compare it from this clip. I hear fans. I hear people. I hear the people on the court clap. Is this what the NBA is going to be like when quarantine is over? No fans? Just hear, hearing the people on the court? Three-point basket. Alfred Payton. Where are the fans? This had, that had to be a preseason game or something. That's my only explanation. That had to be a preseason game. There's no reason for it to be seven total fans in the arena. Who tipped that one? And who point is that? Darko. Shout out to Darko, man. Oh, no. He, he threw it to the other rim. So, no. Just just another another bad play for Darko Milicic's career. Hey. Steph Curry is so automatic. That even when he's not trying to hit the shot, he hit the shots. Instead, they're going to OT. Instead, they're going to OT. And with the rule, only thing Iggy had to do was touch the ball. Because there's no offensive interference on the inbound pass, right? But um, he, didn't, he didn't touch the ball. I don't think he touched the ball. So it's just a Steph Curry shot. You saw it was for Iguodala. Yeah, he never touched it. He just touched the rim. Now, if he would have touched that ball with a pinky, game is over. That's a win. Game is over. That's a win if he did. And look, some of the fans are... are what are you doing? Whoa. Jay Crowder. Unlimited range, bro. Unlimited amount of range from Jay Crowder on that one. Jeez, that's the longest shot in NBA history that didn't count. The longest shot in NBA history to not count. Wow. Look at Jared Sullinger. He didn't even jump. DeMar DeRozan to LMA. No good, but you know how this is going to go. Everybody wants the rebound. Everybody wants their statistics to look better. And, and nobody gets that rebound. But instead, somebody on the Spurs get a bucket. And look at Fizdale smiling. That's why you got fired. Take something serious. Take that for data. Another Steph Curry. Derrick Jones Jr. Before he ended up in Miami. Before he was actually a, a quality NBA player. That's got to be Sean Livingston's first career NBA three. That's all I'm saying. Sean Livingston don't shoot threes. And the one time it goes in... The one time it goes in, it's him just throwing it at the rim for JaVale McGee to go get. At the end of the first quarter, it is 40 to 18. Whoa. Whoa. I'm, whoa, Suns fans. That's tough. And another Clipper, y'all down by almost 20. This is this season, though. Oh, this is the Kuzma. Yeah. The Kuzma glitch. He lagged a little bit. And the shot go up in air. Slim Kuz with the, with the blondie. Crazy. Crazy. I still have not been to the Staples Center, man. I need to get there eventually. And one, though. And one. Take that one. In a bucket. In a bucket. I'm so happy he cut that out with the blonde hair. 
It just looks weird. Omir is chic. Remember, he got a bag? Because <laughs> I remember somebody paid this boy a bag. Former boy, you know. He had a couple years here where he was the 19th man in the rotation and he played his role. Young James Harden. This is like James Harden, what, second year? Second year in Houston? Something like that. Darren Collison bringing the ball up the court. Matt Barnes again. He got a ponytail. I ain't know Matt Barnes is rocking a pony. And three points from Matt Barnes. We'll take those. Matt Barnes has been in like three of these clips already. Whether he's being the one doing the tipping or just on the court. He's just been around for, he was around for a long time, man. And there's Josh Hamilton, number 41 for the Brooklyn Nets. Sheesh. Right? That's his name. Didn't he used to wear face masks or something? Somebody, somebody gonna fact check that for me. Hamilton. That is him. What's his name? Justin Hamilton. It's Jay Hamilton. I remember. It's Justin or, or it might be Justin. Or Jordan. Or Jackson. Something with a J. And it, Omira Sheik sends it to overtime for the other team, bro. Tim Duncan can't do nothing but smile because he know he ain't the one that tempted that shot in. He know what's going on. He, he got the little look away going on. He didn't tip that shot in. That was Amir Sheik. But Timmy D does get the points. Is that Bainesy? That is Aaron Baines. NBA champion Aaron Baines. Let's see. Boris D out throws it at the rim. Amir Sheik tips it in. Wow. That's tough. That's tough. Yeah, I guess I you ain't you don't say, Mr. Commentator. That was all a chic. 100 percent him. Tip Duck didn't touch that ball. And he's just smiling and laughing. That's a legend right there. That's a that's a legend right there. Uh oh. Like a Pella. Good, good tip, KD. You see how Ryan Anderson raises his hand? He's like, I'm, I will get credit for this point, even though I didn't touch the ball at all. Watch Ryan Anderson. All right, man. If you enjoyed the video, it's always for to leave it a like. I'll be back tomorrow to finish up my 7-7, seven seven, and we're going to try to go 8-8, 9-9, and so on and so forth. But I'm out. Peace.